Hey there! Today I have a Stitch Fix to unbox. If you're not familiar with Stitch Fix, it is an online styling service and I'll put some information in the description box below and I'll also put a link up above to my playlist of earlier Stitch Fix videos. So I've been doing Stitch Fix for over a year and I do really like it and I do a lot of other uh, subscription boxes but right now Stitch Fix is my favorite. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead and see what I got. Okay, here's the inside of my box and my packet of information my prepaid mailer to send anything I don't want back. Looks like this month I got some jewelry. So that's that's good. I don't always get jewelry actually. And here's my bundle. So you'll see a lot of navy and some darker colors. Okay, so with Stitch Fix you always get invoice and a note from my stylist and as always my stylist is Holly and I'm gonna go ahead and read the note and I'll scan it and put it up above so you can read it too if you want to you can freeze the frame but I'm gonna read it <laughs> okay so it looks like a promising fix so let's go ahead and see what I got okay so first I got some jewelry and the Stitch Fix jewelry always comes in this kind of aqua colored box. And, hmm. <laughs> okay, so I got a pair of earrings. Let's see what they look like. And these are by Marlin Shift Designs. Hmm. And they are very nice. They're kind of a silver color. And they're $28. Okay, I usually wear, see how I have these little button earrings. <laughs> I like to wear button earrings and these actually are um, ones that I bought from craft fair. My daughter's clarinet teacher actually makes earrings and other jewelry. So I always buy my earrings from her whenever I see her at the craft fair. And she also has an Etsy page. So I'm going to go ahead and put a link to her Etsy page down below. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so these are very different from my usual. But they're cute and they're actually, even though they're big, they're not, they don't feel too heavy because I always kind of worry that these kind of big earrings will weigh down on my ears, but these don't feel too bad. Okay, next. Wow, this is gorgeous. <laughs> it's a dress. See? And it's by Wisp. So it's going to be kind of pricey. <laughs> it's a size 6. And this is the Marnie Knit Dress and it's $68. So you'll see it's got a very nice print and the interesting neckline but yeah very pretty looks very comfortable okay next the top hmm. it's a navy top it's knit material it's by market and spruce size medium and it looks like it has three-fourths length sleeves and kind of this knot in the front and this is the Market and Spruce Ellen Twist Neckline Cotton it's cut off top, I guess, in navy, size medium, and this is $54. So this is kind of pricey for a top, but it is, it is nice. Okay, next. Oh, this is very cute. I, I had asked her for something from Pink Clover because I got something last time. Uh, but yeah, this is cute. It's the Palace Short Sleeve Knot Front knit top in medium and it's in dark green and this is a stitch fix exclusive so yeah very cute i think this will look she said it looked nice with white jeans okay and lastly <laughs> my dress and it's by french gray can you see it and it's a knit dress it has an elastic waist it has kind of interesting sleeves i don't know how i feel about these sleeves I have so many bell sleeve tops and dresses, I think from last year. I'm kind of like not into bell sleeves anymore. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so this is by French Gray Size Medium. It's the Kelton Knit Dress. It is very cute. She said she thought this was a wild card because of the print. She didn't think it was something I would normally reach for. But what I like about Holly, she always sends me stuff that 
I might not pick for myself, but it's always good to try because you, sometimes you might not pick it for yourself, but when you try it on, it actually looks good. So <laughs> that's the beauty of Stitch Fix. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and try everything on and we'll see how it looks. Okay, so here is the wisp dress. And yeah, it, it's, it's very nice. I don't, I don't know though if I really care for it all that much because I know it is kind of kind of pricey. Um, yeah, I don't know if it's flattering though. It's kind of just like straight. And it does have this interesting neckline. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. It's definitely comfortable. <laughs> and I just have it paired with some tan flats. In the style card, she has it with like a, like a bag, a neutral bag. So here is <laughs> the wisp dress styled according to the style card. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not totally in love with this dress, even though it is very nice. Okay, and here is the top from Pink Clover. And you'll see it has this kind of, um, what do you call that, like a twist in the front? And it has contrasting fabric on top, stripes on top, floral. It's a pretty green color. To walk around Sammy. But yeah, cute. And I just paired it with white jeans like she suggested. And these are from Liverpool. And I got them from Mix and Match. And I have these Monroe slides. <laughs> and this, what is this? Stella and Dot necklace. So yeah, very, um, very cute. I do like this. And it's easy to wear, comfortable. You could probably just wear it with jeans also. Okay, so here is the Market and Spruce top. Sammy's still there. Um, yeah, so it does have an interesting twisted neckline. <laughs> I don't know though. Is it straight? Watch out, Sammy. And it has three fourths length sleeves. It's a knit material. It's more on the kind of like the fitted side. But it is nice. I don't know though. It's kind of pricey for um, a knit top. Okay, here is the last dress, and it's by French Grey, which is actually one of my favorite brands from Stitch Fix, and I'm pretty sure this was, yeah, it's a Stitch Fix exclusive, and you can see it has this elastic waist, it has these fluttery, so yeah, I don't think these are bell sleeves, but they're fluttery sleeves. Dog is still here. She will not move. But anyway, yeah, so I like the length. And I don't know if I'm crazy about this dress though, <laughs> to be honest. It is, it's cute. I think it's actually kind of flattering. But I don't know. I, I'm not, I'm kind of like not into like weird sleeves anymore. I kind of like just plain. But yeah, so that's the last clothing item. And I still have the earrings. Okay, so I also. <laughs> wanted to show you the earrings. I did try them on. Usually I don't try on earrings. But these are kind of big actually and they do, they are kind of heavy. They didn't feel as heavy when I just pulled them out. I honestly don't usually wear large earrings but I just thought I'd try them on. So we'll see. If I don't keep them I'll have to like, I'll make sure that I get some rubbing alcohol and cleanse them but I don't know. I might, they might be fun. You know, I don't have any large earrings. They are definitely something I don't have. <laughs> okay, and as far as the other items, I think this dress was very comfortable, but I don't know if I was really in love with it. It was pretty though, and um, I like the brand Wisp. They do have very nice dresses, and I, I think I do have at least one dress from Wisp. And this one was cute too, this um, French gray dress, but yeah, the sleeves, I wasn't too sure about. This top um, by Market and Spruce was actually very nice. I think it was a little pricey though, uh, $54. But it was actually a really pretty top. It looked nice on actually. And this is kind of an interesting neckline. And this pink clover top, you know, I really did like it, but I'm not too sure about the, um, 
the twist, it seemed to kind of come, come undone when I was wearing it. So I'll have to um, kind of see. Maybe I can get a different one. Yeah. But it is, this is really cute. And this one was like $34. So this was actually pretty, pretty reasonable. Okay, so let's go over the invoice. So the total for the entire box is $232. And if I were to buy all five, I'd get 25% off and that would be $58 off and the order subtotal would be $174. So $174 for this entire box. And that's not a bad price. But yeah, honestly, I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't think I'll be keeping anything. Um, I'm thinking about these, possibly these earrings. And I do really like the pink clover top, but I'm just not too sure about the twist in the front because it did look like it was kind of like coming loose. So. Okay, so yeah, so we'll see. Um, yeah, not sure what I'm going to be keeping. But anyway, that's all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I do a lot of shopping hauls and unboxing videos. And if you enjoy those kind of videos, please consider subscribing and I'll see you next time. Bye now. Mm -hmm.